the housing report for Washington County here in February 2020. We have 1,166 homes currently on the market. That may seem like a lot to you, but considering the size of our community, our inventory levels are actually at a record low. We've actually had fewer sales in January of 2020 compared to 2019, just a very slight difference based on the lack of inventory. If we look at our absorption rate, which is just over three months, that's the current supply, the current demand in our marketplace, it would take just over three months to sell all of the homes that are on the market. Now, across all of Washington County, it's taking 55 days for a home to sell on average. Of course, that's taking into account condos, townhomes, and single family homes, which depending on the neighborhood and the price point is going to vary. Anything under 400,000 is moving pretty quickly and getting a lot of action. And specifically under that 350 price point, we're getting a lot of multiple offers on properties. 5,448 homes were sold in 2019 compared to the 5,218 homes sold in 2018. So we did have a 4% increase in the rate of sales and a 4% increase in single family average sales price. That's not including condos and townhomes. And that went from 367,000 to 385,000. There was a 6% increase in the median price of homes from 324 to 345 in Washington County. Because of the lack of inventory, we're seeing our listing prices increase as well. However, sometimes sellers will get a little ahead of the market. So we are seeing some price reductions, particularly in the upper end. If you're priced right, you can expect anywhere from 97 to 98% of list price. However, if you are over anticipating that appreciation, then we're seeing a decrease to about 96% is where you typically will sell your home. So what's the forecast for 2020? Things to look for, there's definitely a lot of new construction. Building is the name of the game. There's also a lot of increased construction with multi-family apartment complexes, student housing, filling a great need in our community, as well as a lot of new zoning in areas for vacation rentals. That's been on the rise as well. Given all of these factors in Washington County, it definitely is a very strong market in which to sell your home. You probably have a lot of equity in it as well. If you're thinking about downsizing or moving up or just starting with an investment portfolio, I would love to talk with you soon.